This is part two of my lesson about navigation pane. Now let me show you. Let me continue. I launched the SS application first, and in here, in click all tables. Click here all tables, and if I click here table and related views. So if you check this part and you will have all the documents that you have produced listed in this way, in a relational way. SS is a relational database. So what that means is all the information in the database are related. If this one, the master one is changed and all the documents that you produced will be changed as well. The, inf the information will be changed. So we can tell that this is these are the files that based on the information from this database. And here one, two, three, four files are based on this one. And these two, now can you look at here, dream class table one, dream class table two. They are two different table, but similar. This is table two is updated one. This is the old one. So look at the, the table. In this one, you do not have the annual wages. Okay, and then later I have put in annual wages into the database. So I have how much they earn here. So obviously this one is different from this one. So SS will save it as an indifferent name. And then from here, one, two, three, you can tell that it's all these files is from this table. So like this one, you want to know when a list of students who are from 11i and make 3 million a year. So you work on here. It's impossible for you to work on here because you don't have that information. So you have to work on here. And then the smart thing is SS will put in separately so you know the relationship between each file and table. So now let's click open this one. Now we have a short list instead of a big table or database. A short list of high earning students from Mr. Lel's stream class like Warren Buffett and he make this much and they are and all the rest and how much they make and they all from 11i. This is what I want. Everyone from 11i and everyone who earn more than 3 million. Okay? So sometimes I need another, some more information like 11p who earns 3 million. So I, again, I can make a query from this table, table 2. So Unfortunately, 11p only have one person make more than 3 million. Okay, so the last one is 3 million of all classes of everyone. So now you got in here, everyone who earns more than 3 million, it doesn't matter what class they are from, are all on the list. Okay, so this is the uh, all about the navigation pane. Just as a summary, this is the navigation pane, and you can click here, okay, to open and close it. Just like a cupboard, if you need it, you open it. If you don't need it, you close so that you can work on it. Okay, and also this icon here, this icon is the icon for query. The green one is the icon for report. And 
and the little bit pink one is an icon for forms so you can choose any information that you want to produce by conducting a query and present it in mainly three different ways a form report and you can also hide some of the information so these are the main basic information about pain navigation pain okay just for comparison this is navigation pane this is across is your is the ribbon command ribbon this is your warehouse where you store your product and materials like a wood for carpenters and this is the where you put the chisels and knife and saw okay I have other videos that show you the details about this so this is the end of the recording about the navigation pane here on access.